Hey, Lee Robinson here from American Sentinel Canine. Wanted to make a real short video to discuss the uh, possibility of breeding American Sentinel Canines. Now, we, the reason why I say that is because over the years we've had a number of people that have gotten a dog or two from us and they've contacted us wanting to know if they could advertise their dogs as American Sentinels or, um, or if they could link to videos of our dogs working to help promote what they're doing. And there's it really just depends. The answer to your question, if you're asking about breeding and selling American Sentinels, you need to read the back of the paperwork uh, on the registration form. And if you don't have a registration form, it's on our website. On the back of the paperwork, it says that the dogs that are bred before their offspring can be registered, the parents have to be proven. Now, some people might think that that's strange that how our registry works. We have a video out there already about how our registry works. It's copied not from other registries. It's copied from Mother Nature, natural selection. Look, if a cheetah has a, has a cub, it has to earn its right to breed. Yes, the cheetah, but just being a cheetah doesn't mean you're gonna catch a rabbit, you're gonna catch a gazelle, okay? You actually have to go run down that gazelle and prove that you have what it takes before you're able to grow up, mature, and earn your right into the breeding status through competitive natural selection for resources. Now, for artificial selection, which means domesticated animals, the competition is going to be for the American Sentinel canine, which is a working band dog, is gonna be either catching wild hogs or doing protection work. And remaining engaged in that combat, even under heavy stress, exhaustion, heat tolerance, um, working pressure, uh, psychological pressure, environmental pressure, etc. So, you know, to answer your question, if you're asking, can you advertise our dogs to promote your puppies? I have no problem with that if you did your part, meaning if you worked your dogs, okay? If you worked your dogs, then yes, of course, you can advertise the heritage of what your dogs come from. But if you want to ride on my coattails and haven't done anything with your dogs, no hog catch and no protection work under pressure, then while you, it's a free world and I can't stop you completely from linking our, our dogs in your advertisements, what I can say is you're a peddler and you haven't done your part, okay? The, the registration states that the parents have to be proven through a breed suitability test before the offspring can be registered. So every puppy that is born from our program is an American Sentinel, but they haven't earned the title of being a band dog yet unless they've passed protection tests or hog catch tests. That test is required in order to maintain the quality of the breed. See, one day I'm gonna pass away, and while my kids will carry on my own genes, the dogs are gonna carry on a lot of my work, and as, also as a teacher, my students will carry on some of the benefits there. I wanna leave a little stamp in this world. Now, I didn't name the dogs after me. I named them American Sentinel Canine. Sorry, I thought I had a spider or a roach. And uh, instead of freaking out, we just want to check it out. But this is the shed, and uh, the uh, it was just uh, this broom, I guess. I don't see anything. So anyway, you got to do your part. Anyway, Lee Robinson, American Sentinel Canine, have a blessed day, and by all means, we would love to have you support our program and continue to be a breeding a breeder and continue this the advancement of these dogs. But you've got to do your part. Have a blessed day.